Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. File Finder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on what is a batch file. You may have heard the term and not known what it meant. Under DOS, batch files were files, they all have the extension BAT for batch, that would run a batch of commands. So it would run things one after another. Batch files could be very simple or they could be very complex. They could use variables like if, go to, start, set, and more. Under DOS, when your computer started, it instantly looked for the auto exec batch file, and that contained important information about things that started up your computer, what programs to load into memory, and so on. Under DOS, batch files were used to do all kinds of things, backup files, move things around, display system status, put up cute little messages, and more. Just for an example, I've written a very basic, simple batch file. Echo off means that it doesn't display anything, and I put that in as a remark, which doesn't display either. CLS means clear the screen. When you say echo and then text, it will display this line of text. Pause, stops the display, and puts up press any key to continue. You can see it's right here. Test bat. So we just type test, press enter, and now it's executing the commands in the file. Now this is a test. Press any key to continue. Press a key. This has been a simple batch file. Press any key to continue. It clears the screen, shows all done, and there's the line underneath it. So that's a batch file, and that's all there is to it.